In today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you guys how to do bay leaf magic and spells in your shoes. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and hello if you're new. Make sure that you subscribe, that way you'll never miss out on another bay leaf video. Okay, so this time I have a really, really exciting one for you guys. I've been doing this for a while and I wanted to share it with you guys because it's very powerful, it's so sacred, it's, it's just a very beautiful thing to do to your shoes to treat your shoes nice and your feet nice and to really cultivate the energy of your root chakra and to connect with earth it's just it's there's so many beautiful things to this thing that I'm going to be sharing with you guys so if you're interested what I'm going to be sharing with you guys is how to spell your shoes it's how to add intention into your shoes add magic into your shoes now for me my everyday shoes are these <laughs> judge me if you want to I love my flip-flops. I don't like wearing shoes. I like being barefoot as often and as much as I can. Like if I go to the beach, if I go to the forest, if I go to the cabin, if I'm in my house, my backyard, my front yard, I love being barefoot as often as I can. And I realized for me, it's because um, my crown chakra is so active, so much. Um, I'm always thinking so, so much. It's really hard for me to calm my thoughts down sometimes. My mind can get over chaotic, overthinking, um, and stuff like that. And so when I, what I've learned is to balance, okay? So when your mind is so overactive, that's your crown chakra that is so overactive, spinning really, really fast. So then you need to balance it out with all the rest of the chakras in your body. And the first chakra that I like to start off with to balance everything out is my root chakra. And how do you do that? Your root chakra is your first chakra. It's like in between your legs and it's everything to do with how safe and secure and stable you feel in your environment, your money, your finances, your career, your relationship, your house, everything. And so I, I like to balance my mentality, my ways of thinking and my thoughts when it's overactive to my materialistic possessions, my physical reality, my physical, everything I can see, taste, smell, hear and touch. Like it's just such a good balance for me. So I want to tell you guys that if, if you guys do struggle with something like that where it's like overactive thoughts, maybe you get, um, maybe you spiral into anxiety or you spiral in negative thinking really quickly, you know, which I find myself doing sometimes a lot lately. And so when I find myself doing that, I, I have to be aware and then I have to do something <laughs> because I don't want to spiral back into like a dark pit. You know, I want to spiral back up so that I feel good. So that's what this video is about. It's you walking into those things that make you feel good. You walking into opportunity. You walking into love. Walking into harmony. Walking into whatever it is, your new house. Whatever it is. We're working with our feet, our root chakra, earth energy, Venus energy, because earth energy is so related to Taurus energy. And Taurus is ruled by Venus. It, if you really, really go dig deep into it, there's so much that goes into it, but I don't have the time to explain it right now, but I can tell you that if you want to work with earth energy, you want to do it with your feet and you want to do it with ash and you want to do it with earthly things, physical, tangible things you feel, taste, smell, hear, and touch. When you burn a bay leaf, what happens? You see the bay leaf, you smell the bay leaf when it's burning you touch the bay leaf because you have to write on it. Um, you hear the bay leaf crackling when it is burning. And then what is it? See, smell, taste, hear, touch. Uh, I think I'm forgetting one. I don't know which one it is, but you, you get the point, right? So it's a very, very powerful spell. So what I'm going to show you now next is my shoes <laughs> and then the bay leaf, what I write on it, how I burn it, how I use the ash. And let's get started. Okay, so what you're gonna need for this is basically your shoes. Like I said, these are the shoes that I, these are my go-to. I wear these <laughs> with everything. Like I said, I would prefer to be like barefoot all the time, that's just me. Uh, I love connecting with earth energy just with my bare feet. I love feeling stones and concrete and soil and grass underneath my feet. 
And so the more that I could be bare feet, I love it, right? But today I'm going to be teaching you how to spell your shoes with bay leaves. And so these are my go-to shoes. So I'm just going to be real and raw and honest with you. Okay? Embarrassing or not, I don't know. <laughs> um, these are going to be the shoes that I'm going to be working with. You're also going to need a lighter. You're going to need a Sharpie pen or something to write on your bay leaf with. Okay? You're also going to need a fire safe dish to burn your bay leaves in. I have an abalone shell right here. And you can use whatever fire safe thing that you have. Or if you have abalone shell, you could use that. I, I think I might have some abalones in my Etsy shop right now still up in stock. So if you're interested. Also, I sell my own bay leaves. If you guys are interested, head over, shop around. But yes, you're also going to need bay leaves. So I have a few over here. And yes, let's get started with our little bay leaf shoe magic spell ritual, whatever you want to call it. Lots of names for it, lots of ways to put it, but basically we are enchanting our shoes, okay? So what you're gonna do is grab your bay leaves, okay? So you're gonna grab, I'm gonna grab one. I think I might just do one so I can just show you really quickly. So on this bay leaf, you are going to write these words or something similar to these words because everybody's different. Everybody resonates with different words sentences, different terminology, diff just everybody is different. So make sure that it resonates with you and matches with you, syncs up with you, okay? So what I'm gonna write here is, I walk into, and your intention is gonna go here, right? What well, I'm gonna write money. I walk into money with every step, okay? Now, you can replace this word money with love, mental clarity, health. I walk into health with every step. I walk into money with every step. I walk into love with every step. I, would, I walk into whatever it is that you need, abundance in every step. I walk into my new house with every step that I, take moving forward from now. Word it how you need to word it, okay? Then after that, you're going to write your entire full name, middle name, uh, birth date over this entire affirmation, okay? So we wrote our intention, now we're going to like kind of seal it with our signature, our name. So I'm just gonna Sign my entire name right there, right? And then over top of my name, I'm going to write my birth date. And it's okay if it looks jumbled up like that because you know what you wrote and the universe knows what you wrote. It's perfectly fine. And what you're going to do after that is you're going to pull in your fire safe bowl, your fire safe dish. Take this bay leaf and you are going to go ahead and burn it. So I just finished burning my bay leaf. There's not too much ash, but then again, you don't want too much ash when you're doing something like this. So hopefully it's cooled down. What you're gonna do is just kind of grab the ash in one of your fingers, whatever your dominant finger is, and then you're going to rub the ash on the bottom, and then you're going to rub the ash on the top of your shoes. Bottom and top. Now, if you're not comfortable putting it on, in the inside of your shoes, whether it's tennis shoes, flip-flops, sandals, whatever you're using, heels, whatever it is, you can put it on the bottom, but I don't really want to put it on the bottom because I'm on my feet to touch it. So I'm just going to grab all the ash and I'm going to kind of, you know what I like to do, just sprinkle it kind of on right there. And then I like to just let it sit there. And then when I just put my feet in there, uh, the bottom of my feet kind of absorbs everything. It's really beautiful. It's also therapeutic for your feet to absorb the ash of bay leaves because it, bay leaves have so many therapeutic like properties. 
Uh, but also spiritually, I mean, you are just putting your intention into your feet and into your shoes. Every time you walk, every step you take, you're going to be walking into your intention. So it could be for anything. You're going to a party. You want all the attention at the party. That's your intention. Put it and put it in your shoes. Walk into the party. You're going to a meeting. You want to nail the meeting. You want to... Um, you want to make an impression at the meeting. Write your intention, put it underneath your shoes, go into the meeting. You have an interview for a job, write your intention to get the job, put it in your shoes, walk into the interview. There's so many ways you can use this spell because we all use shoes every single day, right? And yeah, so that is going to be what I wanted to teach you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed that. Thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know in the comments down below what you use this for. What was your intention for you to walk into? I would love to know. So yes, I hope you enjoyed this. Thank you so much for watching and I'll talk to you very, very soon. By the way, if you guys want bay leaves from me, the big, big, big bay leaves that are charged by me and then I send it out to you, you can get them on my shop and the link is down below. But yes, I hope you enjoy your day. Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you very, very soon. Bye.